talk about the Browns for a minute. So just a few hours after the HBO special aired featuring interviews with two of Deshaun Watson's alleged victims, the Browns QB was in Berea with the team. Now, while this story continues to steal the national headlines, Watson is trying not to make this a distraction with OTAs underway. News 5's Cameron Justice has more on how Watson is working to connect with his new teammates. Cameron? Yeah, today we got our first look at Deshaun Watson in action here at OTAs, but we also heard from several of his teammates about who he is as a person. While Watson is focusing on shaking the rust off following a year away from the field, he's also been working to restore his name as he joins a new team. Teammate Anthony Walker saying Watson is leaving his legal proceedings away from the building. Yeah, I think uh, he does a good job coming in every day and, um, you know, leaving outside, outside and coming in and focusing on football while he's here. He's locked in. Um, you know, happy to be back on the field, happy to have as our quarterbacks. While Greg Newsom said the team isn't prying into the situation. No, nah, and I don't think that's, you know, any of our business. Um, his job in here is to play football, and, you know, when he comes in this building, his job is football, not to tell us about his personal matters. He leaves those outside, and he handles those with his family. Um, and when he comes in this building, we're, we're all about the work. And Stefanski saying the team knows this is something they'll continue to deal with, but still feel confident in Watson the person. I think Deshaun, like all of our guys, uh, are professionals. And when they're here, we have a job to do. Uh, and, and we try very hard to you know, block out and leave, leave outside, outside. And we've done a lot of work uh, on Deshaun the person. And, and there's legal proceedings ongoing. There's an investigation ongoing. So I won't comment much further. Uh, than that, but uh, we understand uh, with respect to that, it's something that we're going to be dealing with uh, as these proceedings go on. So Cameron Justice back out live for us tonight. So Cam, a lot came out of that HBO special, a lot of Browns fans watching, and I'm sure many of them wondering what is the latest on that possible suspension for Watson? Yeah, Delon, we heard from NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell yesterday. He said that the investigation is almost complete. It's nearing the end of the investigation into Deshaun Watson, but there is still no timeline for a possible resolution or any kind of suspension that he might face. So we'll have to see how that goes. But as of now, we are we're not sure about the timeline. Live in Berea, Cameron Justice, News 5. Much more information to come from that. Cameron, thanks so much.